Welcome back to Afternoon Express. Please, if you are cooking along with us, whether it is online, on YouTube, or in front of your televisions, take pictures of your meal, send it through to us. Remember to use the hashtag Afternoon Express in all of your pictures and all of your comments. Now, trifles are not only a summer treat, but our warm winter layered Malva trifle contains some of our guests' favorite things and will hit the sweet spot. SMS the keyword treat to 33650 to get the list of ingredients and recipe. So, Natasha, I hear that this is one of your favorites of all it time. Is. It is. Because you can't find it anywhere else. Like, mm. especially when you're traveling, just like, oh, I miss Malva pudding. <laughs> Malva pudding is a South African favorite, yeah. actually, Fire. And um, with the help of our Woolies already made marble pudding, I'm actually going to let you guys have fun with this one. Um, but what I did, um, just to be different with the marble pudding, I took uh, pears. Pears are in season right now, mm -hmm. and they're easy to find everywhere, and they're very cheap. So mm -hmm. I took them with cinnamon, butter, and some um, lemon peels, and I roasted them yeah. in the oven for like slow roast to be nice and mushy inside. Mm -hmm. So what, are you, what are you guys going to do? You're going to build your own marble pudding cups. Okay. So yeah, I'll let you guys do the cooking, and I'll judge whose one is pretty Art and culture. I feel art and culture. Art, art and, and culture. <laughs> Let's see the distinction close. we got. We're doing some uh, some creative stuff here. Chef Aya, you've already set a huge, difficult... <laughs> it's an idea. But it's an you, idea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But now you guys will just have to play. Okay, just let's have play. Fun. Just I have don't fun. like that pressure. You've just already added fun. so much pressure. <laughs> this is like me asking somebody to come, come on set and act. Yeah, like, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's put this together. So Chef Aya, does it matter the, the order in which we put this together? You know, what I always say is that in the kitchen, nothing is perfect in life. Mm. So you might as well go with the flow, just go with it. Okay, I mean, Natasha, I, it doesn't matter how it's it easy looks. for him to say, isn't it? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> I, I call it rustic. You know, if something doesn't look go. the way it's supposed to look, I say, oh, it's, it's rustic, it's a rustic And then I'll thing. just help you with the cast that here on the side. I've got OCDs also. So, I'm going to try to difficult. I'm going to try to add some custard here in my layers. Yeah. There we go, your turn. Yeah, I'll suck all pieces, you like literally. Oh. <laughs> I put them over first, now you're doing the same thing. That time, okay, fine. Let me not look at yours. Thank Chef you. Aya, please may you be no. very objective when no, you're no, no, picking no, no, your no, winner no, no. here. We we want to see who has the best I layer. I feel like you guys have rehearsed this already. Malva so. trifle. No, I was not sure. Don't give up. Don't give up. No, don't chair. give up. Here. No, don't give up here. Come on, you still have time. <laughs> Our viewers at home, do engage with us and let us know who has the best looking Malva layered truffle. I think that, you know, everyone is a winner here on Afternoon Express. That is just the easy answer. <laughs> but definitely remember to use the hashtag Afternoon Express in all of your comments. And then you can top it off with the ice cream when you're done. I've already scooped some ice here. Some ice cream, yeah. okay. I am trying, Archie. No, you're not trying, you're winning. I think I need a new glass. No, you don't, we'll clean it later. This we'll looks clean beautiful. Or okay. oh, you can actually finish spreading that one, I'll clean it after, and then you can just have okay, the one that's already made over there. Okay. This is how nice I am. This Thank looks you. very filling. This I, I could just enjoy this on its own, Chef Aya, because it adds the creaminess of the custard, of course, the starch and the heartiness that the mouth exactly. pudding so comes Exactly, so the idea through. is all about the warm meeting cold and the creaminess from our clover um, custard. I'm done. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> I was never ready there for that. There it is, guys. <laughs> there it is. This I is, love that. But this is one and this is mine. <laughs> First of all, levels. This one went to private school and this one... I was shown. This went to Harvard. It's crash, like <laughs> kindergarten, absolutely. <laughs> what is it about Malva pudding that just kind of has that nostalgic feeling, brings back those memories of home? Um, I think just the smell of it. I like it warm mm. with ice cream. Like I hardly yeah. have it with a custard okay. because I like that um, warm, that warm, warm and cold, cold type thing. Like yeah, it just, yeah. the contrast is amazing. I love that play and as it's well. quick as well. It's super quick, super easy, and Woolies have taken it a step further mm -hmm. with our ready-made custard, with our ready-made Malva pudding. This is really, really great, Chef Aya. Thank you so much for this. You're welcome. What else can we add to this in terms of fruit, in terms of playing with flavours? You know, flavors? Um, you can play around with, if you love dried food a lot, you can mm -hmm. make like a dry food stew where you're going to like Ooh. have your dry food in the pot wow. with some rooibos. You know, al always bring together the uh, South African flavours because rooibos is so South African. Yeah. So having that stew with the tip eggs in there, let it boil with water and a yeah. bit of sugar with mm. cinnamon sticks. That's beautiful to go with that. Oh, I'm that sounds it. absolutely delicious. A berry fruit stew, have you ever? Now, to get the ingredients list and link to the recipe sent to your phone, simply SMS the word TREATS to 33650. So we continue to chat with Natasha after the break. And, of course, we get to taste all the wonderful food that we've prepared. And she's already taken a step further without me. And I love how she's like, she's always in it. She's always in it. <laughs> 